It's your room. This is where you'll study and sleep for the next three years. Your training starts tomorrow at 5 a.m. Don't be late. Keep up! Find your grip! Use your momentum to swing across! Hurry! Holmes, come on! I haven't got all day! Cover. Aim, shoot. Advance the next cover. Got it? Excellent, Jody. Okay, recruit. Now get rid of those oil drums. Good. Let's keep going.
recruit. It's not a fucking Sunday stroll. Not bad. Not bad, Jody. But if this wasn't an exercise, you'd be dead by now. If this wasn't an exercise, you wouldn't even be able to open your big mouth, Ryan. <laughs> Congratulations, Operative Holmes. You made it. Welcome to the agency. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Jody. Welcome to the agency. Hey, looks like you Great made job, it, Jody. Congratulations. This dress sucks. I knew I should have worn something else. 
dress is perfect. You look great. Who are these people? Ah, uh, diplomats, politicians, businessmen, spies. It's the usual embassy crowd. But the most important thing, act natural. If anyone speaks to you, you just smile. So do you want me to act natural or do you want me to smile? I didn't know you had a sense of humor. Only when I'm scared to death. Ryan, I'm delighted you could attend. Always a pleasure, Sheikh Ahmed. I uh, would like you to meet my assistant, Elizabeth. I was unaware that American diplomacy was undertaken with such disarming charm. The pleasure is mine, Elizabeth. Gentlemen, I give you back your host. We'll talk later on that. Until then, Ryan. He hates me. The whole time he was imagining my head on a stick. I think he found you charming. I should be flattered. Yeah, I'm gonna shake some hands, blend in, find some more quiet. You know what you have to do. Uh, Ambassador, you're a sight for sore eyes. I need to find a quiet place. Hayden, Hayden, are you ready? There's a large painting in one of the rooms upstairs. Behind it is a safe. The documents we're looking for are inside. But there are guards and cameras, so you have to be careful, you got it? Hurry, I didn't. It hurts like hell when you're too far away. somewhere to move the painting find it I didn't حسام اذهب والك نظرة على مكتب السفير حاضر سأذهب حالا شيء غريب على الشاشة شت The camera was on The card's coming Don't move anything or he'll sound the alarm أنا في المكتب كل شيء في مكانه Think. There must be another way. Oh, my God. 
I'm... I think this is crazy. If anyone notices, we're dead. Be careful, Aiden. You know you can't touch other people when you're controlling someone. Okay, now don't move. هل من أحد هناك؟ الرجاء الخروج من هناك على الفور ولكن ماذا تفعل هنا؟ إن هم رهد السيدات انصرف من هنا حسنا. أيها حسنا. المنهرق سأنصرف Sorry, I can't do anything to help you. Good luck. Ryan. Ryan. I was just wondering if you got my email. What? We? What, what? What email? The one I sent three days ago. You know, I've I've actually been having problems with my computer. What? What was the email about? Dinner, tonight, fancy restaurant. <laughs> anyway, it, it's too late now. So maybe another time. 
shit. Shit, I'm so sorry. I... You know, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner tonight? I mean, you wanted to see my apartment anyway, so... Uh, sure, but I... How about around eight? Just... Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. See you later. Now I get why you blasted my computer. You didn't want me to see Ryan. It's not your call, Aiden. I can do what I want. Fuck this. Fuck this! We're not gonna start this again. I'm not yours, Aiden. I can have a relationship with whoever I want. This is my life. Oh, do you fucking hear me? This is my life. You know what? I happen to think Ryan is great. He's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. And I think I'm falling for him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm aware of what happened at the bar. Fuck you for reminding me. Ryan is not like that. Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself look good. All right, books. Okay, on the bookshelf. Okay, great. The trash can in the kitchen. All right, dirty clothes in the basket in the bathroom. All right, there. What should I wear? Oh, hey, Ryan. 
yeah, whatever. I just like threw these old things on because, yeah, I'm cool. I'm cool. Is it not enough effort? Oh, hi, Ryan. I've been waiting for you. I don't know. Oh, hello, Ryan. Oh, do you like it? Classic, elegant. Je ne sais quoi. Classy. It's the new me, and it shows that I can adapt to any situation. You might as well just give up, Aiden. Okay? This date is going on. Period. Aiden, don't be a pain in the ass. Oh, crap. Crap, he's early. I'm coming! Oh, good one, Aiden. Okay, you got me. Now, open the door. Aiden! Aiden, come on, open up! Play games? I can play too. I gotta find something I can make in one hour with what's ever left in the fridge. Asian beef, huh? I mean, that looks good. It's not too complicated. Curried chicken with oven-baked vegetables. It'll take some time in the oven, but it seems doable. Pizza delivery. I mean, it's not exactly gourmet, but it, it, no preparation, no mess. I mean, it could be an option. Asian beef. I mean, it looks suitably exotic. <laughs> as long as I don't manage to fuck it up. Thanks, Aiden.
So far, so good. Ginger. It's supposed to be an aphrodisiac. I mean, it's not in the recipe, but... It can't hurt. I mean, I need all the help I can get. All right, add the sake for flavor. <laughs> I think I'm beginning to like cooking. Ryan, you are gonna love this. <gasps> you know, you're wasting your time, Aiden. You're not gonna stop me from seeing Ryan. Yeah, that's very funny, Aiden. Wow, it's very romantic. <laughs> I didn't behave yourself. Okay, this is important to me, and I'm counting on you. Hi. <laughs> uh, Chateau Margot, 2001. The guy in the store said it was a pretty good year. That sounds good to me. So. What, 
Why don't you sit? Um, I'll get the, um, the thing that opens the wine. <laughs> Cool apartment. Huh? Yeah, thanks. I didn't. For fuck's sakes. Do you want me to open it? No, no, I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> to your new apartment. To my new apartment. <laughs> Oh, so when did you move in? Um, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, the agency found it for me and all furnished and everything, which is... It's actually the first place I've ever had, just by myself, so... It's weird getting used to the idea of it. <laughs> and how about you? Where, where do you live? Oh, I, uh, I have a place just outside of town. Yeah, it's small, but, you know, it's got a little garden and it's pretty quiet. Mm -hmm. And did you, did you grow up here? Or? No, no, I, I was born in Oregon. Yeah, my parents and brothers still live there, but I, I moved out when I was 16. 16? Oh. Did you get, get kicked out or something? Uh, well, things were pretty chaotic at home. My, my stepfather liked to beat me when he had too much to drink and, uh, I just decided to get out before one of us went too far. Um, how did you end up joining the CIA? I, uh, I went through college, not really knowing what I wanted to do. Uh, tried the army. You know, looking for the action, travel, adventure. <laughs> long enough to realize that wasn't for me. <laughs> and when a CIA agent recruiter approached me, I, I jumped at it. Probably, you know, I'm gonna go check on the dinner because this cooking thing, it's a whole new adventure <laughs> for me. You need help? No, but why don't you go sit and more wine would be nice. <laughs> okay. Ah, Asian beef, right? Yeah. No, I was sent to China for a year. I'd love Asian food. Oh, well, do not get your hopes up, because this is probably the second time that I've cooked, and I would rather not talk about the first time. Mm. This is good. Oh, good. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad you like it. So we've been working together now for what, like two years? I know mean, almost nothing about you. Well, I mean, there's nothing much to say. You know, I, I grew up with my parents on the DPA campus, and then, and then Nathan looked after me. Yeah, you know, your parents. Do you, uh, you still see them? Oh. A, a draft. <laughs> okay, are you sure everything's okay? Yes, everything's fine. Iden is just 
He's just feeling a little nervous. It's okay, really. You know, did, did Nathan ever manage to explain to you why you have this link with Aiden? No. I mean, not really. Jody, I, I think there's something wrong with Aiden. Oh, give me a second. I'm fed up with you and your goddamn jealousy. So why don't you just go back to whatever ethereal fucking place you came from and let me get on with my life? Get out of here! Do you fucking hear me? Get the fuck out! It's like, is he here now? Listening to us? And... Yeah. Yeah, he never leaves me. Uh, what about you? Do you have do you have any family here? No, no. My uh, my parents are still in Oregon. Go to see them as little as possible. Mm -hmm. And are you um? Are you married or anything? No, no. I, I, yes, I mean I I, I was. You know, my ex-wife and I have been separated for uh, two years. And, uh, yeah, it couldn't work. I mean, it, in the end, it didn't. You know, we had our good times, but uh, eventually we decided to go our separate ways. How about you? Anyone on your radar? I've got Aiden, so. I mean, anyone in our world. You know, Aiden kind of has always made people run away. Or, or maybe it's me. Maybe I'm just too odd for anyone to be interested in. You're special, Jody. Aiden's got nothing to do with this. Stop. Jody, what's the matter? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's not, um, it's not your fault. There's, there's just... There's some things that I can't forget. It's okay. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry. I better go.